the, the difference 30 to 24, there's six. Do you, is, there, is there a chance that there could be six more suits filed against Watson, given the fact that 30 puts uh, the Texans as claimants? Or once you get down this road, does it, does it, does it get to the point where it, it, it just doesn't pass the sniff test when you're looking at this? Well, I mean, by his own admission or from some of the reporting in this matter, Deshaun Watson allegedly saw 66 different massage therapists within a two-year period. So hypothetically or potentially, he could be facing 41 more lawsuits over and above the 25 who have already sued him. And each incident, each allegation is a separate incident of potential misconduct, which can create a separate violation of the personal misconduct policy. You know, resolving these, the, the, four, the four or five cases that are being considered by Judge Robinson don't prevent the NFL from presenting the cases of others in the future who might come forward alleging a separate incident involving Deshaun Watson. So I, I think we've likely seen the tip of the iceberg already in the 25 that have filed suit that have been whittled down to 12 who voluntarily come forward. And then four out of those 12 that were deemed credible by the NFL. So it's, it's unlikely that there is this groundswell of future accusers that are gonna come forward and sue Watson and, and cooperate with the NFL. But no doubt there could be others. And if there are others, uh, this disciplinary proceeding doesn't prevent the National Football League from investigating future incidents uh, or future alleged victims that come forward as to allegations that took place during the same time period.